we are going to learn about the metric for absolute top of page rate in Google Ads. First, let's take a look at how ads appear on Google search results. When sponsored ads appear for a search query, there are usually three or four ads on the top of search results. Google has recently changed the definition of top ads in a way that the first block of ads that appear on search results even if they are below organic results are called top ads. Like this example, as there are two top ads below the organic results. But for now, we assume that top of page A ads are every ad that appear on top of search results. So in this example, all these ads are top ad for the search query of glass window fix. But the main metric that can differentiate between these top ads is which one appears on top of every other ads. Any sponsor ad appearing on the first position of Google search results is taking the absolute top position. So absolute top of page rate is the percent of your impressions that are shown as the very first ad among top ads. There is only one absolute top impression per auction, so your absolute top impression share is an important indicator of your overall prominence. Having a higher absolute top of page rate can have a significant impact on the overall performance of your campaigns. Generally, appearing on the first position can lead to higher cost per click. At the same time, click-through rate for the ads appearing on the first position is higher too. Some factors that can help you have a higher absolute top position are higher bid, higher historical click-through rate, and the similarity between ad copy and landing page to the user's search query. While a lot of times I aim to have a higher absolute top position in my campaigns, at the same time, it should not be the most important metric in your performance evaluation. Because you need to find a balance, so the cost to appear on the first position justifies it. After all, the most important thing that you are looking to get out of Google Ads is conversions and revenue. As you can see in this example, this campaign received 16% higher absolute top impression share. At the same time, the average CPC increased 10.3% too. So in such cases, you need to see whether the increase in conversions or clicks as a result of higher absolute top impression share is worth the higher CPCs or not. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions about impression share metrics in Google Ads, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more Google Ads tips. Thank you.